Hi, here's a quick video on how to test the TDS level of your water. So this is a TDS 3 meter from HM Digital. So it has a cap, which you can take off to expose two probes. These probes test the conductivity of the water. Water is conductive of electricity if it has mineral content in it. If there's zero mineral content, there's no conductivity. That's why a meter would read zero. And that's what we're going for if we want pure water. So what you want to do is you want to turn on the meter you want to make sure it says zero. On this particular one, it'll show you PPM. The reason why it does that is because this also has a function to test temperature, but we're not concerned with that. So what you're going to want to do is you want to fill the cap with water, either water that's coming out of the tap that you want to test or water that's coming out of your filter. And once you fill it up, you want to stick these probes in there and you want to check what the reading is. Anything below 10 parts per million is perfectly fine for pure water window cleaning. That means it's very unlikely it's going to show up spots. There might be just a very, very faint amount of minerals in there, but not enough to cause spotting. Now, like some meters, like this one here, it also has a hold button. And the purpose of this hold button is you might have some water stored into a tank and you want to take a, a test reading from time to time. Now, if you just put your meter down and you reach into that tank and then bring it out, how is it going to hold the, uh, the reading, right? So that's why you have that hold button there. If you can have your hand ready at that hold button, stick that into the tank. As soon as you know you're dipping it into the water, press the hold button, then bring it back out. Then you can take your reading. Anyway, hope you find this helpful.